How to fix Android, not responding to touch. Restart your phone. This is the first thing we're going to do. Hold down the power button on the side of your phone. You'll see a menu pop up with options like power off, restart, or emergency mode. Select the restart option. Wait for your phone to reboot. Restarting might sound basic, but it often resolves minor touch glitches. If it doesn't, let's move to the next step. Google the issue. Now, this next step involves checking whether other people are experiencing similar problems with your specific phone model. Open a browser on your computer or another device. Type in the name of your phone followed by the phrase touch screen issues. For example, if you have a Samsung S23 Ultra, you'd type Samsung S23 Ultra touch screen issues. Browse through forums or official websites to see if others have reported similar issues. If it's a known issue with your phone model, there might be a specific fix or recall from the manufacturer, saving you time on troubleshooting. Adjust display settings. Touch sensitivity settings can affect your phone's responsiveness, especially with a screen protector. Here's how to adjust them. Go to settings on your phone. Scroll down and tap on display. Look for a setting called increase touch sensitivity. It's usually located toward the bottom of the display options. If it's turned on, try turning it off, or if it's off, turn it on. Also, check the motion smoothness. Adaptive or standard, 60 Hz or 120 Hz, is enabled. You can change this setting as well to see if it makes a difference. Adjusting these settings can improve touch responsiveness, especially if you're using a screen protector. So let's check that next. Remove screen protector. If you're using a screen protector, that could be the culprit behind your unresponsive touch. Carefully remove the screen protector from your phone. Test the touch screen without the protector on. Screen protectors can often interfere with touch sensitivity, so if removing it solves the issue, consider upgrading to a higher quality one. Factory reset, last resort. If none of these solutions have worked so far, a factory reset might be your last option. Just make sure to back up all your important data before proceeding. Go to settings on your phone. Scroll down and tap on general management. Tap on reset options. Select erase all data, factory reset. Confirm the action and let your phone reset. Remember, this will erase everything on your phone, so make sure you've backed up, and that's it.